So you need to back up your iPhone. And after you do this, you find out you don't have enough space in your computer. Right? So what do we do? You have an external drive that you want to back it up to, but you notice there's no option in Apple Music or iTunes to choose the folder to back it up. So this video, I'm going to show you how simple it is. You're just going to have to do four steps to effectively, you know, back up your phone to an external drive. So you can save the space on your computer, or if you don't have space, like in my situation, you can use it. So look, I'll show you. On my computer, I only have about 70 gigabytes available, and my iPhone is like a 512 gigabyte phone. So clearly, this is not going to be backed up. And so I'll show you, for instance, when you go and you look at the backup size, this is, what, 100 gigabytes, right? So we can't back it up. So I am going to show you what you do. So here we go. Go on your external drive. Well, first, we're going to make sure that we start from a blank space. Then click on your external drive, make a folder. I called mine iOS backup. You can call it whatever because I do probably more backups. So I want to know that this is the iOS backup. And in this folder that you make, make another folder. And now you're going to call this backup with a capital B. And then because we have OCD, we're going to clean it up and clean it up again. And then now we are ready to start. Now listen carefully because you're going to need to go to go while you're in Finder. Go to folder. Now your computer may have the routing set up, but just do slash user slash your username slash library. All right. Now we're going to go to application support, but just click on the library because we want to see where everything is, right? Because it's just easier to have a visual, all right? Now click on the application support, all right? Now we're going to go down to mobile sync, right? Double click in there. And you will see another backup folder. Now you're going to delete the backup folder that's in the mobile sync, right? Move to trash. Now that's gone. If you have backups in that backup folder that you would like to keep, you will need to drag that into the folder on your external drive and delete the backup folder that we made. And that's the folder that you're going to use. Otherwise, open up terminal. You could do that from spotlight. Now that we have the window open, bring it to the side of our window and put in ln space dash s space and then we're going to go to the external drive with that backup folder and drag it into the terminal then go to the application support and drag in the mobile sync folder okay press enter and you are done now to verify that that happened successfully double click on the mobile sync folder and you should see the shortcut link that goes to the external drive okay that's it so, again, the backup folder is in your external drive. Now, we can get rid of terminal because all our efforts are done. Now, you can successfully back up your phone on the, your external drive from Apple Music and be happy. Like this video, subscribe and comment.